Welcome to Graphic Island. In today's video, we create print ready trifold browser design. So let's do the printing page setup. Go to the file, new. Here change the unit to inches. And here give the standard resolution for the width and the height. That is 11 inches in width and in height give 25.5 inches. We need to create three different artboard. So here give three. Now from the advanced option, let's choose the printing color that is CMYK, which is considered as the printing color. In case of raster effect, let's choose 300 ppi and click on create. Now let's do the artboard arrangement. Go to document setup, edit artboard, select the artboard and place by attaching one another. Bring this one here and attach with the second artboard. Before I continue with the next step, I would like to thank you Enbeto Element for sponsoring this video. I would also like to thank you all the subscribers who have been viewing Graphic Island videos all the time and make this possible. Now let's continue with the design. We have created the die cut line or the trim line of the design using the artboard. Now we are going to add bleeding section to the design. So from the toolbar, take rectangular tool and click here. Here give the standard resolution of the artboard that is in width 11 inches in height 25.5 inches. Now we need to multiply the width resolution by 3 so that it can cover the remaining two artboard. And after that add 1 inches in width and 1 inches in height. This 1 inches will form the bleeding section. Now arrange the rectangle vertically and horizontally center. So we have added the bleed section to the design and already we have the trim line or the die cut line. Now from the toolbar take polygon tool change the color and click here. Ok. Drag the polygon and make the size bigger. Using shift key, rotate it up to 270 degree. Now by using pen tool, let's draw the line by following the outer line of the polygon. Drag it and extend the line on both the sides. Similarly, drag this line and extend it. Bring this one here and place it at the intersection point. Let's make the polygon size little bigger and take this one towards upward using upper arrow key on your keyboard. By using Alt key, drag the line and make a duplicate and place it here. So every time when you want to make a duplicate, press and hold Alt key and drag the object. This will create the duplicate. This way, keep making the design geometry. Now select them all, take shape builder tool, choose color from here and create shapes. So every time for new shapes, I'm taking different color which will make differ from one another and we can easily identify the shapes we made. Now select the unnecessary lines and the points outside of the design and clean them. Our initial design layout is ready. Now let's add the text or the business information to our design. By using text tool here write more information. Here I am making it firstly because adding text is not a big task here. It's very simple just uh, write the text and add it. Now we need to download contact details icons. So in Enbeto element you can search contact icons. Let's download this one. Click on download. 
here add some text and create your own license add and download our file is downloading here click here open the zip folder and let's open the vector icon file double click here now let's choose the icons that we want to add to our design and drag it to our artboard and leave it here and let's do the arrangement of the icons in a sequence manner add the information accordingly with the icons now let's find a logo from the Enveto element and add to our design let's search with the term logo design and from here let's find a nice and simple logo let's download this one click on download add the license here add and download open the zip folder double click on the eps file and drag this logo to our design and leave it here drag it inside and make the size smaller and place here now by using pen tool here draw a shape select the shape take shape builder tool and delete this select the new shape and hide it now we need to apply images over here for commercial usage you need to use the images which you have licensed so from Enveto element you can download images with license let's select this one and download add the license add and download similarly similarly we need to download two more images for our design 5 million images are available in Enveto element to download with license finding an appropriate image for your design is also a little challenging task let's download this one similarly download add the license add and download so we need to download one more images so here search with the term and let's find the perfect image let's download this one add the license download so we have downloaded all three necessary images now in illustrator go to file open and open those images now drag those images to our artboard now let's do the arrangement of the images so we'll place this one here now select the shape change the color to white bring to the front and let's give some transparency now place the image at the back of the shape make sure the subject of the image should be at the center of the shape now it is perfect let's regain the opacity of the shape similarly for other two images will follow the same process and place them behind the shapes now regain the opacity for the second shape select the shape and the image using shift key and create mask by following the same process let's create the third mask for the third image now let's change the color for the shapes apply gradient color here mix up two different color in gradient if you want you can add one more color here 
by using gradient tool let's fix the color angle similarly apply color to the other shapes select this and transfer the gradient color and make changes in gradient color from here Change the color of the text and you can do the rearrangement what we have done. Using rectangular tool here draw a rectangle. Let's release the clipping mask from here. Take shape builder tool and delete this lower portion. Now remake the clipping mask select this one and transfer this color let's make changes to this gradient color let's apply blue color group let's download the QR code from Enbeto Element website so in Enbeto Element website you will find all the necessary things to download for graphic design once file is downloaded, click it, open the zip folder, open the design and drag it to our artboard and place it here. Double click and change the color for inside shapes. Our design is ready now. Select the first artboard and save the design one by one. Here give the name save. Similarly select the second artboard and save the second artboard design. Here give the name again and save it. Select the third artboard and save the design. Here give the name and save it. After saving designs, now we need a mockup to create a realistic look. So from Enbeto Element, we can download the mockup file. So let's choose a nice mockup for trifold browser design. Let's download this mockup. So here add a name, create license, add and download. Now click on zip folder, open the mockup file. So this mockup file will open in Photoshop. Now in Photoshop, open the images that we saved from Illustrator. Now drag our image over the new tab of the mockup and leave it here. Drag the image using shift key and fit it within the mockup page. Mark it, unmark the background and other layers. Only keep our design layers visible. Close the tab, yes, and wait for the mockup to be applied. Once mockup will apply, we can see the result here. Similarly, apply our next two design on this mockup. Let's apply the third design to this mockup. Drag our image, fit it within the mockup page. Close the tab. Wait for the mockup to be applied. And here is the final result. So, hope you understand how to create print ready trifold browser design. You will find all the necessary resources what a graphic designer needs.
in one place that is Enbeto element. Enbeto element announced end year offer sale. If you take subscription now, you will get 50% discount, which will be less than $20 per month. Check out the offer link of Enbeto element in description as well as in comment section. And here I am Abul Mansur. Wish you all the best. See you next video. Have a nice day.